Update 2 on what is now Super Typhoon Von Fong. And not only is it a Super Typhoon, but it is the strongest storm in almost a year and the strongest storm we've seen this year with winds of 175 miles per hour and a pressure of 900 millibars or thereabouts. Its current position is 17.6 degrees north, 133.2 degrees east as of 8pm UTC on October the 7th. The storms are expected to, convert, uh, to curve northwards uh, almost immediately as a Category 5 storm before beginning to weaken as it heads northwards, probably due north towards the uh, Japanese islands, the Ryukyu Islands, um, and then affecting that area as a significant typhoon still and could still reach the uh, southern tip of mainland Japan, the island of Kyushu, as a Category 2 storm. Uh, obviously that remains to be seen. It could even still be stronger than that or indeed weaker, depending on how things go in the, in the next few days. But looking at the sea surface temperatures, they remain very warm uh, all the way up to those islands. But where the storm is at the moment, it's in very warm amounts of water, the warmest in the whole ocean by the looks of things. 30 degree temperatures uh, likely to drop off just a little bit over the next day or two. Wind shear is very low and remaining low, it is actually decreasing ahead of the storm, so still uh, low amounts of wind shear. Uh, perhaps we couldn't rule out possibly even some more development of the storm from its already very powerful position. Uh, this is the uh, satellite imagery of the water vapour. You can see a very moist environment around the storm, dry air over China, uh, but nowhere near the storm itself. So looking at the computer models, the CMC first of all takes a storm towards the north affecting Okinawa in particular looks like a landfall as it stalls over the area and then moves out towards the, the open ocean once more. Uh, we also have a storm forming in the Indian Ocean, Invest 99B, which could become a very significant cyclone making landfall in India. The GFS model has a more straightforward track for Vonfong meanwhile with the storm crossing through uh, Okinawa again by the looks of things and then affecting the rest of the Japanese islands after that uh, but either way it looks like Okinawa will not have such a fun time with the storm but those are only projections uh, the actual outcome could be different so the latest satellite imagery shows a storm that's extremely strong extremely well organized um, it actually resembles a high end to some sort of degree uh, with how almost perfect it is I suppose um, a very uh, circular eye uh, no real imperfections with that whole core around it very strong typhoon conditions in there of course wind speeds 175 miles per hour sustained even higher gusts possibly pushing 200 miles per hour and of course a very heavy rainfall in there as well. Luckily, no areas will see Category 5 conditions, thank goodness, uh, but that would, of course, cause uh, very devastating conditions. As of October the 7th at 8pm UTC, Tropical Storm Simon is almost no longer with us, but that's not quite the case yet. Uh, just about to move over the Bay of California Peninsula of Mexico and, of course, Invest 99B, which is now in the Bay of Bengal and could become our next uh, major storm. In 2014 so far we've seen 63 tropical storms worldwide, 35 of those have become category 1 cyclones with winds of 74 miles per hour or above, and 21 have become category 3 storms with winds of 115 miles per hour or higher. Of course, this was the uh, number 21 tying 2011 now in terms of major storms. You can visit Force 13 on any of its six outlets. The website, force13.com, will keep you up to date as much as possible, at least when I'm not ill. Uh, and, of course, the video page is YouTube and Daily Motion, Force 13. Just search it on there. Um, whenever there's a big event like a Category 5 storm or when there are warnings in effect, there are usually regular video updates on there, unless there's good reason, uh, personally. And, of course, the social pages, Facebook and Twitter. Just search Force 13 on there, at Force 13 on Twitter. And you can speak to me personally on Skype, at Full 13 for Tropical Weather Chat on there. The next update on this storm will follow in 24 hours time at around 8pm UTC on Wednesday, October the 8th. That's all for now.